Caribbean queen. Now we're sharing the same dream. And our hearts, they beat as one. No more love on the run. What's going on, baby? Today I'm coming to you with a hot sauce review, Pepper TV style. I finally got in from my buddy Patrick coming out of Florida at hellofasauce.com. We collaborated together and came up with a sauce for the Muscular Dystrophy Foundation. Uh, this is a Bishop Brad Sauces for Causes bottle. It's a part of my charity collection. I want to thank you, Patrick, very much for collaborating with me and creating a wonderful, wonderful hot sauce that had a vision of the islands on it. And a giant. Let me just show y'all this thing really quickly. Look at this thing. I know a lot of you probably have gotten y'all's already. This one was. Th these were autographed by me and by Mr. Brandon Drybroat, the average Joe, as well as Patrick himself. And these sauces, uh, what they. These were actual peppers that were uh, sent to me. By uh, and, and these were the peppers that were used. These peppers were donated by Craig Richardson, Jacob Dethridge, Chance Brooks, and of course myself. And uh, these peppers, what we did was we created a certain amount of bottles for them. Let me show you this. This is going to be the taster. This is what the collector comes with. A beautiful tag. Has a, a story on it. Let me, let me read this story. As a matter of fact, it says, it's the story of me calling him up and... Uh, Asking him if he wanted to collaborate on a bottle with me. And he made it into a beautiful tag. And uh, did an incredible, incredible job on it. Chris T, be quiet! Damn, dog. I love you, boo. I love you, boo. You're my grandma, boo. But be quiet. But this right here, let me tell you. Let me read you these ingredients. Now, these ingredients that come out of hellofasauce.com... He has a particular recipe that he uses, and um, it's a foundation of an actual Caribbean sauce, and uh, he, it's pretty much his base for his sauces, and it's, uh, it's uh, no artificial coloring, additives, preservatives, crushed pepper, vinegar, salt, lime, garlic, and onion, and this is made with a, a, a bunch of different super hots, man. I can imagine how hot this thing is. I've never had it. I know people have been enjoying it. Um, but I do want to say this on marketing, on artwork, on label for the Caribbean love, baby. Caribbean, I am a Caribbean man. I'm all about love. And you know what? This is the, this, the, the nectar of the gods when it comes to chili love. Hot sauce is. So Caribbean love. Guys, there's only six of these left. There's only six of them left, and by the time you, you need to contact him, I'm going to put this down here in the description, 100% of the proceeds go to the Muscular Dystrophy Foundation. So let's get this rolling. Marketing, artwork, label, I gave him a 9.5 out of 10. As a matter of fact, I gave him a 10. 10 on marketing. He nailed it. It's very Caribbean. I love it. And uh, it reminds me on if I went on vacation somewhere and I was sitting at a cabana and I needed some sauce and I saw this, it would just... It gives me that feeling of the islands and of a, of a Caribbean style sauce. So, yeah, he gets a 10 out of that one. I love the way, if a, if a sauce and its label, its label can make me, take me to a place and make me feel something. Um, that is a very, very high rating in my book because I love marketing and artwork and labels. Okay, here we roll, baby. They come with a dripper. That means it's hot. Ooh, peppery. Peppery. Ooh, it smells good, man. The vinegar, the lime, the onion, and the garlic, and the peppers are making my nose hairs curl a little bit. Ooh, it smells good. This is one. This smells like one that you'll want to uh, take your time with at first, so you can judge where you stand with it. All right, on aroma, I give him a, a seven out of ten on aroma. Very peppery, very good. All right, here we roll. <clears throat> Boy, you're going to need some Caribbean love after tasting that. 
Mm. This would be excellent. Excellent on tacos, man. Uh, a vinegar-based sauce. Definitely a vinegar-based sauce. Tasting a lot of the lime. And the, but the garlic and the onion are is blended very well. <coughs> the peppers are hitting me in the back of the throat, baby. Uh, now let's do this. On flavor, for the Caribbean love, I would give him... I give him a seven and a half out of ten on flavor. If it was on food, it would it would take it to a whole nother level. But I love the uniqueness of it. I love the uniqueness of it. Yeah, if this has been on food. It'd probably be about an eight. Um, on heat, I give it a seven and a half out of ten. Actually, yeah, I give it a seven out of ten. Seven out of ten on heat. I sent him a lot of peppers. Um, very good, man. You did good, Patrick. I love the base on this. Got a good aftertaste. Good after flavor. But a lot of the lime sticks out. A lot of the vinegar kind of sticks out. Now, the lime's overbearing the vinegar, which is awesome. Um, but the onions, the garlic, the peppers, it's blended very well. All around product. For the Caribbean Love Hell of a Sauce from hellofasauce.com. I'm going to put that down here in the description. There's six of these left. They're limited editions. Uh, add to your Bishop Brad Charity Collection and Sauces for Causes. Do something good and great. 100% of the proceeds going to the Muscular Dist Dystrophy Foundation. Golly, my saliva glands are... Mm. I give him my eight out of... I give him... I give him an, uh, an 8 out of 10 on this. I give him an 8 out of 10 on this. All day long. This sauce is good, excellent, and will go on your favorite type of foods. Uh, but this is Bishop Brad, baby, coming to you on Peppa TV for y'all's hot sauce review for the Caribbean love, baby. Don't forget, go get you some Lionel Richie and put on some Caribbean Queen. I'm going to see y'all, baby, on the next video. Bye-bye.